We tend to think of the ESB as a communication layer, and that's principally what we have here. So really what we have, the Enterprise Service Bus, is supporting different service interactions and a variety of different types of protocols, but there are three main types of communication layers that the ESB is going to be working with. First is one that was, was pretty well described here, the whole concept of service interaction, uh, where we have the SOAP messages coming in on one end, uh, the ESB is basically pulling those particular messages in, we're, we're applying security, we're doing all the auditing, we're doing the message transformation, uh, we're doing transaction-based processing, and that's, that's typically when we think about an enterprise service bus, that's typically what we're thinking about. Uh, the most simplistic scenario is just this basic concept of different services on either end communicating with one another. Another variety here, another layer here, is this integration pattern here. So we have a lot of different kinds of systems that we can plug into the ESB beyond just uh, .NET or Java types of services. So we have all kinds of enterprise technology here. We have database concepts. We have purchase package systems. All of these are going to require some type of an adapter, some type of a JCA, the connector architecture type of adapter that can, we can tie in here. So when we're building components that, that can be deployed at the ESB level, inside of those particular components we can apply these different types of adapters and we can pull in uh, different things that we normally would think of as service components like database access and file accesses. In addition to that, we have some basic management capabilities here. So every enterprise service bus is going to come with some type of administrative ability. We're going to want to have the, uh, the capability to, to monitor and to manage what's going on inside of the ESB itself. We want to see what's happening. We want to do performance and tuning. We want to do benchmarking and things like that. So that's another communication level here that we're going to be dealing with. So when we think about this particular piece, we're thinking about the, uh, the BAM concept. We're thinking about business analytics here uh, where we're capturing statistical data about what's happening. But this also means that we can go in and we can do administrative functions and we can manipulate uh, the ESB itself directly and the components are deployed there. 